get to Shelby's tank. Yeah, we're out here with Treasure Monk, Gentleman Jeff, Loretta Kid. <coughs> and we're about to do some detecting right out there. So, in the summertime, normally there's a lake right there. Right now it's just a bunch of mud. The lake has retreated because it's drained for repairs. <coughs> And all that big mud puddle there is usually an extremely busy resort beach. I mean, there'll be a couple hundred people out there every day in the summertime. First time it's been drained in 10 years or so. So we're about to get in there and see if we can find some rings and things. Up there's Chimney Rock. I mean, I've literally, like, just being there, like, in the summertime, I've literally, um, like, stepped on some gum, like, what is that? Pick it up, and there's, like, a whole snorkel. There's stuff in there. Yeah, it could be stuff in there. Should be. That's where they filmed parts of Dirty Dancing. Up there is where they filmed, uh, Last of the Mohicans. I think Firestarter was filmed here, so, cool place. Let's see if we can find some rings. Alright, so we're with Jeff. We've already dug a couple bucks and change. Beautiful view. Obviously, though, we're, we're looking for gold. And I'll just pop this up. I think that's probably fake. Yeah, that's fake. But, first ring, we've only been here about five minutes, so. That's right. We got about three dollars and quarters. Yep. Can't go wrong. Alright, we're digging. Got a nickel. We're digging a lot of change, haven't been showing it, but. I would. This is a deep signal. It looks like an old ring. It's worn. I'm trying to see if it's marked. Uh, probably silver. Looks silver. Alright, we'll find more. Alright. I got an earring. Could be silver. Doubt it, but probably plated. Alright. Jackson Relic Kit. It's the one thing he wanted to find. What'd you get? Ring! Let's see. The precious. Big old gold ring. It says Jesus. Jesus. Good job. Does it make you invisible? Where'd he go? <laughs> Relic Kid's digging. And I got some signals. Let's see. A few in there. And one over here. I'm going to see if I can... Uh, I apologize for the video quality. It's hard to do this one-handed. This sounds like coins, but I thought we'd just show y'all. Quarter. That might be it for there. What do we got over here? We got a dime. And that might be it for there. And he got a 1983 penny. He's digging. Beautiful views. Jeff's down there digging too. I think we've got three or four rings now. All right, everybody's digging. I'm digging too, and I got a giant diamond earring. I think it might be fake. Get another quarter out of this hole. Looks like 
Rhode Island, I think. Massachusetts. I don't think there might be more, but I think that's probably it. Well, Jeff's digging all the earring backs, and I'm oh, yeah. digging all the earrings. Oh, we got to see his ring. Ah, stinks down here a little bit. Oh, man. That's a real one. Yeah. <laughs> That's a real diamond. <coughs> Woo. It was a very nice signal. 14K. All right, Relic Kids reading. Treasure monks across the pond. Been digging for a while. Dug a lot of coins and aluminum crap. And I just finally got a ring. It's like a big old titanium wedding band. Well, that just fit me. Taking a little break for lunch. Waiting on pizza to get here. It's windy. Cold. Just watching these clouds sweep across the mountains and slowly move. it was you know they fought to defend it and uh, early settlers drove them out eventually uh, around the time of the revolution and shortly after and some of the first settlers here about 1801 I think and multiple people reported it one of them was a doctor claimed that um, they came outside and there was a big cavalry battle in the air like they came out and first of all there was giant people and horses and things with swords on top of those mountains there and then they rose up in the air and they were floating through the air and they had a big cavalry battle and a sword fight which is an unusual story to say the least but interesting i guess we're mucking about in the mud getting nasty nasty old jackson's reading i got another ring it's all tarnished from being buried in the lake, but it's marked 925 turkey, so it's, I guess it's Turkish silver. <laughs> Heavy, man. It came up all muddy. I thought it was going to be gold, but it ain't. May have to call the rescue squad. There's no swimming. You almost got it. A few more steps. Gotta break the suction. Don't put your weight on the dais. Huh? Don't break your machine. No, it's tough. Make the ramp. We'll let y'all know if he makes it. Alright, we got the Tree Talker Traveler Relic Cousin there, and I got Relic Kid. Don't pull on it, but you just gotta unhook it and unknot it. There's a hook. Um, but we can do that later when we clean it up. And I just dug this blazing Mr. T. Start wearing that to work. Alright, 
doing our cleanup. Nice day. They run us off. Not because we're not allowed to be there, but because it's time to close the park. Um, it's Jackson stuff. Some quarters. Penny, glow stick, and his ring. My stuff. A flashlight. A bunch of quarters and stuff, and just a mess on Jeff's tailgate. Diamond earring. Not real. Uh, nine month sober AA token. That's not yours. <laughs> uh, bunch of quarters. Some little jewelry type things. Uh, a couple earrings. Another little jewelry thing. Um, my fake ring. And my good ring. And then this rock sets off the detector and we're trying not to get hit by cars. And here's Jeff's stuff. This is, you did not find this here either. Huh? Is this from England? <laughs> it's like a <laughs> copper. <laughs> If Jeff found that here, it's a copper. <laughs> well, if like I did, a, it was in. It's like a half cent or something. I don't know. Um, earring, piece of jewelry, something. Earring, bunch of coins. Big old heavy titanium ring that fits him. And then, probably the find of the day, the diamond ring. Can't beat that. <laughs> what do you think? Yeah. Ooh.